Um, hi, my name's Kevin. Kia ora, my name's Tero Baker-Jones. Hi, my name's Cecilia Kohamatangi and I'm a Unibound mentor here at the University of Auckland. I'm one of the Unibound mentors here at the University of Auckland. Um, I'm just from down the road in Orewa and I'm a Unibound mentor for 2021. Our programme is an academic enrichment programme. Um, so it's pretty much a five week course where you get to hang out with some of the mentors, you know, we teach you a few things about uni, you know, the hacks and whatnot that you need. You've got mentors, you've got student support advisors, you've got people who want you to succeed, who want you to make it across that stage. Uni's a really hard place to succeed for anybody. What Unibound does is it, it gives you that, that bit of extra help and you hit the ground running rather than just being chucked straight in the deep end. I remember when I first came into Unibound, so I started uni, um, it's pretty nerve wracking kind of walk into an institution and you know don't really see many brown faces here to have the ability to kind of make it easier for you know future Pacifica students Māori and Pacifica to come to university and kind of make that transition a bit easier means a lot. Uh, I started in science and maths and physics originally and stepping into that you know first day um, coming from Unibound and looking around I just saw there were no Māori no Pacific students you know that sort of you know, really encouraged me to, to come back and bring a few more students through there. Make that difference between too nervous or don't know what you're doing and can't get into uni um, versus, you know, making it all the way and going through your whole degree. So I'd love to see more representation, which I think is why I'm here. Being in an environment like with a lot of our Māori and Pacifica students, um, you know, there's quite a lot of things that um, our students face that not a lot of other students may face, such as like fire lobby lobbies, um, you know, church commitments, family commitments, and it's um, being able to understand each other and having that mutual understanding that we're able to help each other um, to succeed. You sometimes got a bit of family pressure or the kind of, that weight on your shoulders, kind of sometimes being the first to come to university kind of thing. We carry it with you too, so kind of trust us because we know, we know what it's like and we've been through it before, so don't struggle alone kind of thing, you know. My grandpa growing up, I mean, the one thing he always told me was focus on your studies when you, go up every day seeing mum and dad off to work just so they can give you that opportunity that they never they never had coming from the island. It means everything to my family, you know, um, the sacrifices that they make, me being in the space and like, you know, succeeding. It definitely does their sacrifices justice. That's what we um, want to do and that's what we also want to help our students do when they come to this program. Looking around to my Fano and seeing how many of them, you know, never made it to uni. It's, it becomes a bit of a cycle, you know, it's nobody goes to uni so nobody has the encouragement so nobody gets the chance. But I think having, you know, Unibound, the idea is that we put this idea out that it's sort of a transitional space in between your home cultural life and the university life. And it's a space you can sort of, you can be in without having to have this massive shift in your thinking. Um, but throughout that whole period it allows you to build up um, and get used to the idea of going to uni, I think.